So this is the south slope. This is coming down actually exactly the same way I came up this morning. So this is less eventful than the top, but um, yeah, some pretty cool stuff. Yeah, so this, you can see the entrance down there to my left. That's kind of the side entrance. It's not as kind of amazing as going through the, the, the one I went in on the last video. The, uh, uh, what's it called? Propylea? Propylea? The main gates are obviously <laughs> amazing. But this one's pretty chill. Lots of old ruins here um, being restored. And just up here, there's a temple, or not a temple, the Theater of Dionysus is just up here. If you look at my last video, I kind of got a shot of it looking down. This will be in the same level. Oh. Yes. Yeah. 
Be careful with shoes. This place is a bit like a slip and slide. There on the left, you can see the Parthenon, where I just was. had a free pass to the underworld. Take the soul back there. Così, 
Bom, gente, vamos, vamos, vamos. O próximo aqui é a Horta. the theater of Dionysus <clears throat> all of the green up there that used to be it used to be part of the theater apparently it used to be huge okay, we're getting close to the end now So there's not much to see after this, but the main thing I think to see here is if you look behind me, um, just the scale of this. When I walked in last night, my first time in Athens, I just walked up this road. Everything was closed, but it was still light out and just it's just huge, right? That was built in about 450 BC. Acropolis is not just this place. Acropolis means any, all cities in Greece have an Acropolis, which is usually a high point protected with walls. So after I leave, I'll just walk up to the, I'll keep my camera until I get to the hotel. I got to take a bathroom break. I want to grab my computer too, so um, you can see the little promenade they have out in front here. 
check out the lines coming in too. When I first came in here, there was like five people coming in. Definitely get here early. Ticket for her, mm -hmm. and then you'll pass. So you'll skip this line. Okay. Are Understandable. You? Thank you. Damn! Look at that line. There was no line up when I got here this morning. Uh, if you're coming here, definitely buy your ticket in advance online and get something called the skip the line pass. That's the one I had. Like I said, it wasn't crowded when I got here today, but um, had it been this crowded with my skip the line pass, I could have just gone right to the front. It'll save you a long time. And it's not even summer season yet. I imagine uh, in another month, this lineup will be up the street. There's actually a metro station just up on this, to my right here. You can see it there on the right up the street. And had dinner at one of these restaurants last night. Not bad. And haven't been up there yet. You can actually walk all the way around the Acropolis on the outside. You probably should use Google Maps if you do, but. part of the city, obviously, uh, not because we're getting to McDonald. My driver, uh, Nick, yesterday, I had a, hired a driver to pick me up from the airport and also take me back today so I don't have to worry about my schedule so tight. I don't want to mess around with local taxis or anything. So yeah, he drove me all through these little side streets. This is the one part of the city when they redid it in the like 60s and 70s, I guess. They couldn't really redo this. This is my hotel. It's called the Air Hotel, Hotel Parthenon. It's nice. About 109 euros a night. Check out the elevator, it's pretty cool. Hold on.
Oh, good timing. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Hello. Hello. How are you? Very nice. And you? Good. Thanks. Just saw the Acropolis. It's amazing. Oh, wow. the seven wonders of the world. Beautiful. Right? Yeah. And, uh, right next to it. Amazing. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's all for now. See ya.